Hello everyone, this is a video about my revamped Patreon. After being told to improve my Patreon, and after thinking about potential rewards, I'm here to re-announce it. I have a Patreon from my channel that offers benefits and rewards to those who are willing to donate to it. I called it the Robert Charity, because after all, you're supporting a plagiarist who steals things from other people. As previously stated, I revamped my Patreon to include new rewards to whoever uses it. Here, I'll be going into all the tiers and discussing the perks and rewards in detail. All of these options are priced in Australian dollars, so it'll probably vary by country. First we've got Thieves, the cheapest option. For $3 at this tier, I offer early access to most of my big videos before everyone else, such as my TCW review series and other videos that take me a while to complete. At this point, I only offer it a couple of hours before I release it to everyone else, but since I've only got three patrons as of this recording, I'll probably extend it to a few days if I'm able to get more. Next I've got Robbers. For $5, this tier offers exclusive voting power. Again, I only have three patrons, so it probably won't be active until I have more. But as soon as I get enough, I'll start doing exclusive polls. The polls will probably consist of advice on what I should work on next, and stuff regarding critical feedback. Next, we've got Ripoff Artists, which at $15 offers limited fan requests on top of the two previous options. What I define as limited fan requests are requests concerning video essays, debunks, and short reviews, and that sort of thing. Then we've got Serial Plagiarists. At $30, I offer full fan requests such as critiques on whatever topic, and it doesn't have to be Star Wars, as well as various other things. It can be a game, a book, a movie, or a TV show, or a comic. Side note, you should probably ask if I'm able to do something or not. I'm sure I'll be able to do most things, but sometimes I won't. So just make sure before you become a patron, because I do have some ground rules like no pornography, no over-the-top gore fest, and no anime, stuff like that. As well as that, I have another tier which is just a joke, but it is an option. JJ himself. This one is priced at $500 and has the same power as Serial Plagiarists. This option is just a joke, so I don't actually expect anyone to pay that much monthly, but I can dream, right? It wasn't easy picking these perks because I want to be more accessible than other YouTubers. Anyone can send me a message on Discord and I'll be happy to talk to them about anything so exclusive conversations were out of the question. I want to be as in touch with you the audience as possible. I haven't been able to do fan requests much besides Star Wars because I get a lot of them and I can't do them all. And let's be honest, money is a huge motivator. I know a lot of you will probably be bummed out about the fan requests being a Patreon reward, but there will be occasional exceptions like response videos to recent videos and such. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll answer them. I don't make a lot off of YouTube monetization, so some extra income from you would be much appreciated. Also, I'm open to other rewards if what I offer isn't enough for you. A lot of the money I make from YouTube, I use for YouTube, such as thumbnail art and such. One thing I want to save up for is a PlayStation 5, so I can play upcoming games like Star Wars Jedi Survivor and whatnot, and other stuff optimized for the most powerful hardware. But the problem is, the cheapest one I can find is around $800, so it's going to take a while. But with that being said, that's my re-announcement of Patreon. I wasn't sure if anyone was willing to donate to the robber charity or not, but it couldn't hurt to ask directly, because I'm not sure whether or not majority of my audience knows about my Patreon and what it offers. I'm JJ Plagiarisms, and until next time, what are stories but mystery boxes? Oh.